Yo, this is a great way to start the day, y'all. Oh, man, I told y'all on Sundays that's when it started like more so relaxing, you know what I mean? Last night I was out to like four, I think about 4.30 a.m. to doing Uber. It was a good night doing Uber though last night. Super busy, a lot of people out kicking it last night. You know, that's one thing I noticed about Cleveland. It's always going on Saturdays. On Fridays, it can be kind of iffy because Fridays people are either trying to go home and go rest because they just got off work or they doing other shit. But Saturdays is like the kick it night, y'all. So that means, you know, money night, you get me? But I decided to come here and start my day off the park. Posted my vlog earlier, man. So they just want those smooth days, honestly. Like I tell y'all, my Sundays will be just for relaxing and just, you know, being peaceful for real, for real. And that's about it though, for real, y'all. And also, once at the park, I was talking to my bros here, man. And they was like, hey, man, you should get a new banner. And I was like, what y'all thinking? They was like, you should get the lavish journey. And I'm thinking like, you know, maybe I should go ahead and invest in that big banner so now people can see the lavish journey as soon as they click on a podcast or whatever. You know, just another marketing idea. If you were an action figure, which one would you be? Action figure. I'd be um, Static Shock. Static Everybody Shock. forgot about him. Who is that? Everybody slept on him. What does he but do? He had the electric power. Why would you be that action figure? And he rode on an electric flying skateboard. Oh. Okay, so that's what you're gonna do? I was thinking about being that for Halloween, but the costume's funny. Okay. Oh yeah. <laughs> thank you, thank you for answering that. Hey, bro, quick question, man. Oh, is he pissing? <laughs> oh shit! I gotta redo it now. All right. No, hey, it's too late now. Damn, hey bro, hey, I ain't peeing, if you were an action figure, which one would you be? If you could be an action figure, action figure? Yeah. Like or like an action, like a superhero or something? Yeah, something in that category: action figure, superhero. Hey man, you know that old. Remember that old Power oh, let's, Ranger? Let's smoke. I gotta, I gotta, Remember that old Power Ranger toy? Uh -huh. The where you used to press the shit and it would flip the heads on on the on the Power Rangers. It's they make it like a dinosaur head. No, no. I don't it'd remember like, that. It was like regular head and then it flipped to the Power Ranger. I would be a Power Ranger. Remember. You'd be a Power Ranger. Which one? That, that's from the like the. It would have to be like white or green. Oh, okay. Like the Power Black Ranger. Black dogs get adopted least. Out of all that. dogs, because they're black. Is that so? Is that true? Is and that you a fact? I don't want the black Power Ranger. How many black Barbies? Like green how many Ranger, black Barbie bro. dogs? I like that green. You see Ranger, little bro. girls with. I don't know, bro. No, nah, you don't see them with no black Barbie dolls. My little they're sister nice, had. My dog. little sister had black Barbie dolls. She played with them. Yeah. yeah. I mean, it's all about just enjoying, y'all. This is a beautiful tree, man. Look at that. Fall time at its finest, y'all. We coming live from Euclid Creek though. This is why I be recording after the vlog. I used to come right here, read for like a good 30 minutes. But man, this view right here is always beautiful, y'all. Look at that shit. And usually like you come here like in the morning, so kind of like mid afternoon, it's peaceful here, it's quiet. But man, it looks so beautiful right now. Just look at that tree. I'm so fascinated at this, y'all. Garbage time. Don't, no, don't, don't put this on here, bro. I'm serious, you can't do that. Bro, what are you, what are you, slow? Ma! He's talking bad about me. Don't you stop, man. Look, now y'all seeing him behind the just camera, Just delete this, man. Bro, I'm gonna shoot your camera. <laughs> it's not even showing the screen. It's just Dude, showing your face. Delete the part with the, where it's showing the screen, man. See, I'm, I'm keeping all this in there except for that part. I'm gonna show what kind of person you are. Would you just help me? Uh, you're making me really, really mad, and it's making me hot because I got a lot of adrenaline going. I got a flu shot, and it's a lot of stuff going on with my buddy right now. I really need some assistance, man. You're not helping. This is that guy behind the podcast show. Fuck. What's good, y'all? Coming live from Freedom Crib, brother JB, right here. <laughs> they just saw you yelling at me, so I mean, don't be fake now. Oh, we got Freedom back there. JB, legendary. You already know how they coming through from the land. Damn. Yeah, boy. Bet. We about to uh let's go freedom. Uh oh, about to switch it up. Hey, we about to head to this hunter house. Somewhere. And I got a flu shot. So we got a flu shot. No, you about to be sick in the next two days. Oh no, I already, I already got it. <laughs> and you got sick when you after you took it? No. Oh, you know sometimes people my get throat, sick. My that. throat was hurting for a little bit, but that's my windows was open when I was asleep. Oh, okay. That's, yeah, that's the worst I got. Are you Other sure? No, I'm good. Yeah. Okay. 
I've been around this. Oh, damn, this nigga has been sick. Yeah. Y'all ain't gonna get my phone. Oh, man. This liquor gonna help. This, this right here gonna help it, y'all. <laughs> yeah, I'm chilling orange it's juice. Doing it's gonna help. I went, little, I went through that sick phase already. But it hit everybody different. Like, mine, it's not like, oh, you real sick. Mine, I'm like, oh, your throat hurt. And then it's like, all right, you good. Because my immune system is already strong. Okay. But yeah, we about to head to Hunter House. Now, I think it's like the Hunter Forest, some shit. I've, you know what? I've been to house, house all year. I'm not going through no forest. Fun fact of the day, I've been to Hunter House every single year since high school, y'all. That's a long that run. Is, yeah, ever yeah, since high school. Cool. I've been every every single year since high school. <clears throat> it's been like over 10 years. I'm on a 10-year <clears throat> run, y'all. But you know what? They're not as scary to me. They're just fun, to be honest. You know what I mean? Let's go. What? What? You want to talk to the camera, too? You want some, you want some camera time. I What's my attention? I really don't. I really just need your help, man. I don't. You want some attention? Get that. <laughs> that, that, that that Libra is that who he is? <laughs> it's uh, it's yeah. that Aries. Yeah. That's the Aries in him. An angry orchard, crisp apple, crisp. Yeah, uh, we come alive from the fear forest. Probably won't be able to record too much. Just want to go ahead and show this entrance real quick. And yeah, that's it. Yeah, we coming live from Steak and Shake. You already know, got the four dollar burger right here with some barbecue sauce on that. You know what I'm trying to say, man. Four ninety, no three ninety nine joint. Smiley face. Got double fries. You know. Everybody got good food. We got some chicken sandwich over here. We got we got the chicken the bites over there. Guy. Yeah, you got the chicken the bites. What face. you got down there, Jeremiah? What's that? The fresco yeah. melt? Yeah, that does look good. Yeah, that look good. Don't forget the seeds and the sauce. Oh, like that. shit. Oh. Well, y'all see this freedom bit into his chicken sandwich. What she got over here? She got this, but she drinking that cocoa. She going in with that. And we got JB over here. Man. Smiley face. Oh, we put a smiley face on the burger. <laughs> what she got over here? She got a burger too with the lime inside the water. I'll see you guys later. You know what, y'all? Today was a magical day. Today was one of those days your boy just kind of woke up and went on about today with zero expectations. And I know I have those days a lot, obviously, throughout the week, but today I literally had no expectations doing anything. And as I went to the park today, man, I saw people from high school. I saw two people from high school, right? I had showed them my lavish journey page and everything. It's like, oh, that's dope. You know, of course, all the good positive vibes. And it's like, hey, bro, one recommendation. I was like, hmm, what is that? It's like, you gotta change that background. And I was like, what you mean? They was like, man, you should get a big ass Lavish Journey banner. So as soon as people click on that, they can see the Lavish Journey. And you know what, y'all, that's funny. So I thought about that a while ago, man. It's just right now, I'll be real. I can't afford it right now. I can't spend $250 on the banner right now. But when I can, I will. But it's just crazy that when you meet people, man, that have even nothing to do with kind of what you're doing, but the advice they give you can help benefit you in a massive way. That shit is dope, you know what I mean? I, I, usually, I don't really try to network with people who's not in my field of category or not trying to get to who I'm trying to get to, but lately, I've been realizing that it's bigger than that. It's all about just meeting people, period. You can meet anybody in the world, and they know at least one thing that may benefit you, you know what I mean? It ain't gonna be everything, but it may be that one thing. Like today, how they told me about, you know, I should get a big banner, and I should put LEDs around. It's just, it shows you that you really gotta put yourself out here and meet people simple as that man you gotta have fun you gotta meet people and that goes to myself because sometimes like i say i like to stay around a certain kind of people and certain amount of people but lately this whole month life has kind of been just throwing me out there to, to just be around just anybody to be honest anybody that matches my energy obviously i go about to hang around nobody with no bad energy fuck that but overall y'all the journey has been great man and yeah of course we went to the hunter house today y'all the hunter house was it was all right i mean yeah, it wasn't really all that, to be honest, y'all. I get that hunting house like a 6 out of 10, to be real, y'all. But you know, like I always say, I go for the experience. I go for the fun, to be real. I don't really go to get scared anymore because I am older. I've been going to hunting houses for like, whew, probably like 12 years in a row now, y'all. That's crazy when you think about that, man. I haven't missed a season since, I think, high school, man. So almost about 10 years or so, I've been going to hunting houses, man. But this one was kind of corny, but... Like I say, though, it's better than just sitting at home, not doing shit. It's all about experiencing life, man. That's one thing I've been doing all month. Like I tell you from the get-go, this whole month is all about just experiencing life. And I've learned so much within the last few weeks by just simply just 
meeting people and just living life, man. It's so amazing at what you will find throughout the journey when you just throw yourself out there to the world and simply just interact with people. It's like a lot of my strengths this month has came from communication, you know what I mean? That has been really big this month, me communicating with people, me breaking out the shell, me just doing whatever, you know what I mean? It's amazing where I am right now and it's amazing what I'm doing and I embrace it so much that most of the time I can't even comment on it. I just gotta live in this right now. I'm just enjoy it though, man. But while this being said, my family, I'm slumped, of course. I'm gonna see y'all tomorrow. Peace and love. <music>